This season's road to master rank is a farewell. A sad farewell to our favorite Pokemon in the game, EX Pokemon. When I heard they were going, I knew I'd miss them. And I put together a dream team of people to give them the send off that they deserve. So me, along with some incredible friends like Chris Heroes, Super Teeds, Ender, and more, are saying goodbye to EX Pokemon. Gone, but not forgotten. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing really good. Thanks for hopping on and doing this. I really appreciate it. That's okay. Um, I'm excited. Nice. I, I, I haven't played for a while though. <laughs> no see problem. how that goes. No problem. <laughs> if not, I can send it. Um, oh yeah, you have two accounts. I can't remember its name. Was it? Well, there is a, Cowboy Nuzzy. I want to guess it's it that. It was Cowboy Nuzzy, but now because of this series, I have changed its name. So. Oh, do, why? Why is it because like people like know it's you and they? I don't know. Did something happen because of no, that? Or there actually was a time where people would, if I was like starting a new road to master rank or something, people would just look up my account and on the first video they go, "He wins this one, wins this one, win loses this one." I was like, "Don't what? do that." Yeah, that happened a couple times. So I was like, "Don't Wait. tell them." Uh, that is so unfun. Yeah. What? All right. So here we are. Teeds, <laughs> thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. One of the legends of Pokemon Unite. Woo! And when I think about the legendary Pokemon sadly losing their EX classification, oh, I had so to bring sad. in a legend. I had to bring in a legend. <laughs> the legend. I get it. Legendary. Um, mm -hmm. Also, I just want to point out your name is so funny. Buffy 2 I I love that. Yeah, we got. We I have love that because that's have... who I'm playing today, and I also agree he needs a buff. Let's go, buff Mewtwo Y. You'll be playing the Mewtwo Y for us. That's perfect. <laughs> what's what's uh what should I play? What EX Pokemon do you just love to see? Um, so who's Ho Oh? -Oh? Is that the recent one? That's the recent one. Ho Oh. Oh, right. oh, oh. Whoa, oh. no, wait, we're gonna have three of them. Okay, so, so our ally took an EX Pokemon. This could be really good. Uh, wait, I want a full EX team. Uh, who do we need? Well, need. <laughs> Which... Who we need? <laughs> we're playing EX. We don't need anyone bet EX. That's as true. long as it has X on it, it's good. That's true. We this could... is the kind of X you want to keep around. We just need one more. If I wish someone would switch over to Maridon right now, it'd be kind of perfect. <gasps> Oh wait, okay, so my question was, because yes. I, I I know that a lot of them were OP. Was there any EX Pokemon that came out that wasn't OP? So her I actually don't know too much about. Yeah, that's I was the, a MIA for that. That is the only one that has come out and been relatively in line. It's still insanely powerful, but it's in line mm -hmm. with some of the other very powerful Pokemon in the game. <gasps> as opposed to Zashi and Mewtwo were unbelievably broken, and then Maridon was considerably broken. <laughs> Oh, I was not here for Maridon either. No, <laughs> I mean that's good actually. I don't want to. I I, so I don't know if say so Farlings is not legendary no. on paper, but um. So Farlings, I remember I played when he was out and he just bullied me. And was that just me just being bad, or was he actually like good? Where am I going? Uh, oh, you're you, going. There. You you want to go center or you want to go top? Uh, we. Can... <laughs> I'll, I'll go I'll center. <laughs> We can share it, whatever you want to do. <laughs> I trolled. Um, but either way, uh, yeah, uh, Phalanx was actually crazy good. Fa here's the thing. Uh, compared to the EX Pokemon right now, Phalanx is probably, or was before its nerfs, probably better than all of them recently. Not when they released, of course, when they were absolutely insane. What was the oh. craziest one you remember? Like, were you uh, playing a lot around Mewtwo Y? Um, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but like when I think about crazy and this is gonna sound really bad I am very aware of how crazy they were but it's just like there are some that really leave an imprint mm -hmm. in you with trauma yes. and I, I you know to throw back some which I'm, I'm sure you love is like Mr. Mime for some reason just sticks out a lot like oh. a sore spot <laughs> yeah well Mr. Mime had that <laughs> that crazy moment Mr. Mime was like way too powerful uh <laughs> <laughs> Once it got the hollow air and they did like those weird Mr. Mind buffs, yeah, it was way too strong. I, I kind of wanted them to come in. They decided never to, never to show up, sadly <laughs> enough. All right, leaving. See you, Teeds. Yeah. But yeah, oh, Mr. Mind okay. was crazy powerful, of course. 
Um, mm -hmm. I'm trying to think, like, that was one of the metas you, that you remember is like the mime, it was like mime Mew Glaceon, the first time that whole oh, thing happened. That and Greedence, sad. that one also sticks out. Oh, of course. That one was so long, right? Mm -hmm. That was a really long one. It was long and Actually, very broken. Wait, who was the longest? Who just reigned for the longest time in Unite? Uh, well, Zacian had one of the most, like, it was like almost the entire year. I feel like Zacian. It's what? <gasps> really? You know what's crazy? Do you ever, like, have this thing where it just hits you how long we've been in Unite for? Sometimes I'm like, wait, it's, we're in our third year in Unite? That is I know. so crazy. Isn't that weird to think about? There was, um, there was a moment on broadcast the other day, like, a few months ago, like, during the regional championships, uh, and Doobsnack said to me, you know, like, well, this is what's going on. You know, this is year three of Unite. And I, I literally... <laughs> Not as a joke. I went, we're in year three? And he's like, yeah, <laughs> hey, man. Wait, wait, that was on Twitter, right? Maybe. I, I honestly... I think I saw that tweet. Yeah. And I had the same reaction, actually. <laughs> well, it's just a weird thing to think about. You're like, oh, yeah, I guess we are. But I kind of forgot <laughs> that that's what was happening. It's very weird. It's very it weird. It is to so weird. Oh my gosh. I can't believe that. Time goes so fast. It really does. And in that time, you had a new baby as well, right? I do. Congratulations, by the way. Thank you so much. <laughs> Is that being fun? Oh, it's the best thing ever. You're never nice. going to... Nothing's ever going to be better. It's, uh, it's a lot Are of they... responsibility, uh -huh. and it's a lot of joy, and you never get to sleep. <gasps> I'm trolling. I'm sorry. That's life. Mm -hmm. So will they be in Hawaii as well? Yes. Like maybe baby's very young. Uh -huh. Oh, they will be? Oh, because Hawaii is not that far for you, right? It's not a as crazy well? trip. This is kind of going to be uh, our first little family trip, honestly. He's eight months old. He just turned eight months old, like, yesterday. And he'll be there. Eight months? Wow, that uh -huh. is so cool. Yeah. Oh, they're going to be watching you. That's like family goals. Yeah, it's going to be Family goals on... I don't think they're gonna Ooh. like. Well, he won't care. He's just, you know, he's eight months. Uh, he'll, he won't have any. I, I don't know if my daughter will really care about the casting oh, part, okay. but I think she'll think all the Pokemon stuff is really cool. <gasps> she didn't go to Japan, right? Mm -mm, no. Oh, how did you like Japan? Japan's the greatest. My wife immediately amazing. was like, "We should move." We should, we should <laughs> I was Japan. the same. I didn't go to the Unite one, but I, I went to a, on a Japan vacation. Yeah. And I know exactly what she's talking about. It's the best. It's just, yeah. Um, there are some places you go where you're like, this is really cool, but you don't immediately think like, oh, I could live here. Japan was, oh, we, we should live here. This would be awesome. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. It was very Okay, very I'm going to cool. be... It was gorgeous. Wait, this is what ho -Oh, I don't actually know what he does. All I know is that his ultimate, like, revives people, uh -huh. right? Or something? Yeah, his ult will bring uh, us back to life. Um, us? That's cool. It is cool if it happens. It doesn't always happen. He brings... Oh, wait, not the enemy ho -Oh, Our ho -Oh. Sorry, I was... <laughs> I didn't see how I didn't even know we had one. I forgot we had one. Yeah, no, the enemy I, I will the, <laughs> the enemy will revive us just to KO us one more time. It's pretty cruel. <laughs> so I was like, that's so cool. And then I was gonna question it afterwards. But you're like, huh, that's a weird one. But at the same time, I think Unite can do some really crazy things. So I was like, you know what, that's fine. I I I'm not surprised anymore. Well, uh, yeah, honestly, they they the it's weird. Unite has a history of some really cool choices and some really ah! weird Sorry, choices. Sorry. You know? It's... What's their weirdest one? Like wait, hold on. Coolest choice? First? Yeah. Uh, this Charizard is so mad at me because for one second I took my jungle and <laughs> it's it did stop him from evolving. I didn't want to stop him from evolving. I thought he still would, but it was also a buff <laughs> that I was going back for. He's he's not happy with me. I get it, but oh, he just needs to let it go. <laughs> Uh, well, their weird choices are like, well, like, okay, rank protection cards. That's a weird choice. It's a weird choice ah, also mm -hmm. because it's, it's not relevant to how they pair players, but it is mm -hmm. just like a weird, it's a weird, like, look, you know? It's like, why would you even do that? It, it doesn't really make sense because you could still pair with players in Ultra if you're in Master anyway. So what's the difference? Why why mm -hmm. have this like arbitrary thing? It just they do weird things like that. I think a lot. <laughs> yeah. And the coolest choice. Dodrio, baby. <laughs> of 
necklace. I, I think sometimes their Pokemon choices and how they design them, I think they genuinely make really fun stuff. That, oh, yes. Say. Yes, they do. I love Mewtwo Y. That's why I think they should buff him. So your name, when I saw that, made me so happy. Uh, also, I do hope that... um. Because sometimes my viewers like to say, Tease, you haven't been here for a while. I just want a preface to the people that do watch this on my channel. That is not true. I don't want me to, like, to be strong again. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I guess you do have to. Like, I'll, I'll make a lot of tongue-in-cheek jokes. Uh, and then every once in a while, people are like, really? Is that actually what he wants? <laughs> How about now? Are they like... Is it still happening to this day, or are they more like, oh, Spurgles, well, Spurgles saying Spurgles things? What'll happen is, like, uh, I just recorded earlier, I had uh, Chris Heroes on, and we were kind of talking about stuff, and I know, like, sometimes I'll joke about him getting, I said he got his first Penta KO with an EX Pokemon, like, he finally got a Penta, <laughs> which, of course, is not true, he gets Pentas all the time. He's oh, a wait, I player. just, sorry, I just did a trolling me too, I think, and ulted. I was, I was so invested into your story. I just wasn't paying attention. That's how it works, Can too. you please... <laughs> Sorry, go on, please. So anyway, I think some people will be like, he never got a Penta before Mewtwo Y. Like, people will think that for a second, you know? I think things like that will happen. I don't know uh, why. I don't know. So is this like a, a thing where people just can't read, like, sarcasm or, like... I think, yeah, it's a little bit of that. And, you know, sometimes things are tough over the internet. You don't know Ooh, who's I telling the that. truth. Who knows? Are they hitting? Mm -hmm. Can't be hitting. Are they? Ooh. Uh, I... mm. Ooh. Um, I'm betting Sprigati Dard. Uh huh. Where'd it go? I was gonna try to I save you, but it's gone. He <laughs> 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 just left. <laughs> uh! Oh, Pika. My HP's low. Oh! <gasps> Wait, what did I die from? I don't know what I died from. I actually want to know. I have a feather on my body. What yeah. does that mean? That means that Ho could bring you back, but I think they've Please do the it. Move. They don't have it anymore. I'm not worthy. No. Is it because I'm level 12? I'm, I'm a level 11. I'm worse than I thought. No. It's okay. Um, They actually do need to get it. So I'm just going to farm for one sec. I'm level 15. Oh, that's just, cool. I'm just going to get some AOS energy here for this fight. Oh, he's so dead. Nice. Let's go. I don't mean to uh, say this because I know you and Charizard have some beef, but me and Charizard are really synergizing, and I feel like we're gonna have a really good friendship out of this after this game. You and Char are gonna be uh, you're I fast friends. <laughs> Char and I, we just don't <laughs> like each other. We're never gonna get along, and that's okay. Well, I'm gonna invite him to our party after this. That's great. So. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I'll stand on it with you. Thank you. There you go. Ho oh, oh, tried to nice. leave. You, leave you to the Pikachu. Leave you to the wolves there. <laughs> <laughs> so what so who was oh, the no. am i the first person in this episode or was there like before that i don't know if when you upload these uh is it like instantly or this episode is not it's not instant <laughs> no i don't i don't <laughs> upload my videos instantly uh <laughs> you will you will i think you will be the second person in this series i've recorded a couple of them but i think it i think you'll be number two in the series i think oh okay so i can know who the first one is because they're going to be uploaded first right that's right the first so person the first will be chris uh i believe is chris, gonna be the let's first go. One. yes and you will be the second. I don't have as many on this because I, I just picked a few people that I really liked and I wanted to do a few games with it. I didn't know if I wanted to play EX Pokemon for like 10 hours straight. So <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would just be fun well, to have uh, have it with a few people and then move on. I gave Charizard a thumbs up, by the way. I gave him a thumbs up before I gave you a thumbs up. I'm so sorry. I'll give you one. <laughs> <laughs> no, at this point, I don't want it. <laughs> Take it back. Take it back. <laughs> uh, do you? What other ex do you have? Do you have? Uh, mm. You don't have Ho, -Oh, I or do you? Um, let me have a look. Actually, okay. I, I have Marides on, but I'll be real. So I think the biggest flex I have on this game is that I have not played any <laughs> ex Pokemon except U two Y for like a nuts luck that I did. Oh, so sure. who's like the most OP now? Mm. It's maybe Maridon, maybe Zyla Me? Wait, well, that's a lot of pressure. Yeah. I'll try. We all I am really have... good at not showing the OP part of Pokemon. So okay. we'll see how this goes. Well, that's a skill in and of itself. <laughs> it really 
really is, actually. It's not easy to take something OP and be like, look, that didn't even look that good. You know? <laughs> That's not easy. Well, I tried Zashian when he was really OP, and I... It was very embarrassing. I almost didn't want to upload that video, but it, I didn't do very <laughs> well on Zashian, which is so crazy because he's extremely easy. It, you know, we have a comfy. We have a comfy. We don't have another uh, legendary, sadly enough. So, so are the Crustle players still like Insane. the goal getting strat, or are they like, <laughs> do well, they do something else now? It's interesting. So, I, I love like getting these questions because actually a lot changed with Crustle. It became a top tier defender for a while, and now it's still what? really, really good. Yeah. Wait. And people actually kind of completely went away from like the whole goal getter cheese strategy because rock tomb or shell smash and x scissor became like a top build for a while ah uh, okay cool, uh right? uh learning on the go let's see where am i going um Ooh. you are going, going this way? Playing with crossle okay. so right now he's not the top tier defender no but it's very good no. Oh, so I, I should expect big things from this guy, from our guy Cash Money Twenty Four. I'm always expecting big things from my <laughs> random allies. I think that's <laughs> that's a good way to live, you know. Get your hopes really up every is. game. That's how that's how oh. I like to play. Is Buzzwell still good? It's funny. Wow, this is so fun. Okay, so Buzzwell is not as good anymore. In fact, it's one of the lowest win rate Pokemon in the what? game. What? Yeah. I think that's the last thing I remember, meta-wise, is that he was good. Yeah. Or oh, was he not good? Is my mind, like, failing me? Maybe my memory is, like, bad. No, you're 100% right. He was good. Very, very good. Uh, and it got nerfed, like, midway through this, like, competitive season. Wait, I have potion. Shit. It got nerfed. Uh -huh. And uh, since then, it's completely fallen out of favor, sadly enough. Oh, okay. Wow, my cross is, like, popping off. You're right. Well, you're right. You were the one who believed in him. <laughs> you believed. Yeah, but I only believed him because of like the lore you gave me. That's true. I did. I did a I <laughs> quite a yarn that I spun there about this Pokemon. So you excited for um? Well, you obviously are very excited for Hawaii. Yeah, how about you? And they you? do like um. Oh yeah, super excited. I'm very excited because it'll be the first time um. I'll be like, not hiding behind my VTuber thing. <laughs> yeah. What? So it uh? Did you go to Japan? I can't remember. Um, not to the Unite Japan, but I went to Japan, like, separately at a different time. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I am talking about for Pokemon. Uh, <laughs> so, okay, so, but because I know you went to London, they they flew you out to London, right? To, yeah. To see yeah. things, and uh, I didn't see you yeah. at London. I don't know. I don't remember what happened. Oh, right that was, like... So, that was funny, actually. Hold on, I'm like a bit stuck. One second. Yeah, no problem. I don't really like fighting these people. The enemies? Um, yeah, I just... I want like a peaceful Unite game. Is uh, there a peaceful mode? Yeah, you just uh, run around at Rayquaza. Half my allies play peaceful <laughs> Unite. <laughs> <laughs> I think, yeah. There's a lot of that. Uh, so, I think at that... I th I'm sure maybe as a creator, you can maybe somewhat relate. I don't know how much you can relate, but, like, you can get into, like... Or maybe... Um, yeah, I don't know. But when I first started Unite, it was a lot of, like, work. Mm -hmm. Like, a ton of work. Yes, yeah. Um, yeah, a lot of sleepless nights. Mm -hmm. So, London was in our first year, I think, of Unite. And I was... Did not have access to work. So, I was like, wow, I, I just can't work. And I slept so so much in London. I think I slept for like 15 hours on the first day. To be fair, I was like flying from Australia. Mm -hmm. So it was a really long flight. But I remember like Stefan um, asking me where I was. Yeah. <laughs> I had to well, tell him I just slept. That's interesting. Yeah, yeah, the start of content is really fascinating because it is like kind of... Um... It is <gasps> like it's oh, all consuming, Sorry, right? I remember when you first started, like you were like figuring out attack speed and you were up all night testing things and oh it, yes it is like a weird time especially at the start of a game when we don't know anything because i remember watching your videos like your your videos were some of the first videos i think everybody saw um and uh. you would have videos like going through like these intense concepts and my videos were like i put mm -hmm. a rocky helmet on wiggly let's go <laughs> <laughs> rocky 
helmet on Wiggly. <laughs> that is hilarious. So yeah, it yeah. was a lot of it was a lot of time spent doing those for sure. I think I got a bit burnt out from doing that, which is why I don't do them anymore. But it also because like I didn't handle. I don't know if you are good at that. Do you are you good at that handling like comments that aren't very good sometimes? That's I'm hard. just getting eaten alive. It, it it it's hard for sure, right? It's uh it's no fun. And you always remember the negative stuff, and it's hard. It's hard because oh, you'll get sure. like a hundred positive comments, but then someone will be super negative, and mm -hmm. it can like it can sort of upset your whole day, or or more than your whole day, you know. It can. It can. It's like sometimes it's like those good days where you're like, you know, that's fine, whatever, and then you have those bad days where you're just like, man, why? Um, so I, I did struggle with that a bit at the start, mm -hmm. uh, especially with those testing videos. It get it got really heated with like uh because it's basically like oh well i think this is right and <laughs> so uh -huh. it was a bit rough yeah now yeah, this... people will you'll even because now everything's more like figured out there's like the math cord and stuff like that things are more figured out people still argue with it oh math cord is so good i'm so dead wait go oh, no what so who are you playing oh me too you're Mewtwo. you are the uh other ex pokemon yes i'm the other yes. so since it still looked down upon to play X Pokemon. Can I still be like, oh wow, we have a Mewtwo on this team? I think even though it's you. I think we'll always have a little hate in our hearts <laughs> for the EX Pokemon, no matter what they do to them. I think we'll always be like, ew, Mewtwo, give me a break. Wow, I'm squishy. So do we know why they made that change to to let everyone have EX Pokemon now? They said player feedback said that they did not like EX Pokemon and they wanted to balance them with the rest of the roster and it's no more EX. It's just time to have them balance for the rest of the game, which is <laughs> crazy that they act. This is like, it was one of the best decisions they ever made. They normally don't make good decisions. They make a lot of decisions where you go, really? <laughs> Again? And this time they actually went, hey, you know what? Everybody hates this and we're not gonna do it. Which was cool. Oh, oh, um, um, what was I going to say? I had a thought. One second. Let sure. me think about what this thought was. I was saying EX. We have them. They made a good decision. People hated it. Uh, <laughs> trying to Thank jog you your memory it. somewhere in there. <laughs> Negative comments Wait, online. this is really actually productive. I like this. Hold on. I'm going to, if I don't win with this comfy on me, I'm going to be so upset. Oh, I'm doing the old thing. Um, I lost to the Buzzwall, who is like the weakest Pokemon in the entire game, and I'm the strongest Pokemon in the entire game. So, what do I take from this? That's uh, we call that a skill <laughs> diff. Uh, so it's when one player's <laughs> skill is the difference maker. That was not me that started that surrender. Right? I know it may look like that. It was just really off timing. Oh! It would kind of be hilarious if you did. Ooh, <laughs> fun unite. Thank you. Look Wait, this is my time. This is not my time. It's because it, I have potion, isn't it? I gotta say, our crustal did just push that Regilecki in, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> but are you really playing Crustle if you don't do that at least once every second game? You, you kind of got to do it. You, you can't you be that to. mad at them. I mean, their moves push things around. Anyone could make that mistake. I would not be surprised if that was like in the Crustle 101, mm -hmm. how you want a main Crustle book or something. I would not be surprised. I'll admit, but I kind of find it like nostalgic. I feel like I'm going to admit something to you, Teeds. Is yesterday on oh, stream God. as Talonflame, I pushed Reggie Alecki into our tier two, <gasps> um, completely on accident, and I went, yeah, you know, I just tired, like tired of that. The team didn't need to uh, keep focusing on that. Oh. I just like. I came up with an excuse oh, in real no. time, but in, in reality, I was like, you know what? That's actually pretty stupid of me. Uh, <laughs> I could I could justify it after the fact, but I really can't. It was just a bad, bad call on my part. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, maybe. That is hilarious. You know, I think the most, the one clip that I can remember like really well, that's so memorable from you is the, the bees when you were like, I think you were. Oh no, we're, we're, we're cooked. We're cooked. No, no, we got this. It's, it's, oh, you know what? No. You play way more than me. I believe you. <laughs> well, if you're telling me to give up, I'm going to give up. Nobody's, nobody's center. Somebody's got to run. You have a unite move. If you run center, you never know what could happen. Okay, I so it, my unite move it. cannot reach from here, right? Oh, no. <laughs> they've already got it. <laughs> wait, I'm uniting. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Hold on, sorry. No, don't look at that. What, wait, what, cl what clip are you talking about? Something with the bees? Sorry, I cut you off. What was so it? you were, were you like being back to, I think it was like really 
famous, actually, this clip. Oh. Um, you were, I think you were going back, and then the, you, and then the beast spawned, and you died. I don't actually yes, remember. I know you what might you're be something like about. that. Yes, uh, I was, I was basing. Uh, I don't remember what Pokemon I was. It was like Gardevoir or something. And just where I was standing is where the bees spawned, and it took me down right there. And then I made a clip out of it. I think with oh. like a, the Nick Cage movie where he, the bees are all <laughs> over him. Mm -hmm. and I yes. That. That, was, that, that was, was the one. one. That, was that is the most memorable one for me. Like, you know me for testing. I know you for that one you beat. For the bees clip. <laughs> that bee clip was so good. It was very fun. It was a, it was a good time. It's uh, yeah. Moments like that are great when uh, you're in good spirits. When you're in bad spirits, oh. moments like that are like, this is the worst. Wait, has this happened more than once? Like, has, has it happened again? And um, you're just not... You're just not in the mood for it. Like, I, I just don't need this Not today. to me. I know there have been players. There was a big moment in a tournament where a player got KO'd by a bee. They were an Absol, and uh, they were kind of, like, popping off, doing tons of amazing stuff. And then all of a sudden, boom, B. It was called, like, people were calling it the MVB <laughs> of the match. They took him down. It was, uh, it was a whole MVP. thing. MVB. <laughs> it's pretty good. Yeah. MVB. That is amazing. Oh, so um, I think this might be the biggest L that we both have ever held in our lives because we had two EX Pokemon, <laughs> one of them, both of them being pretty strong and we lost the game. We did lose. They took us down <laughs> and the enemies should feel good about it, honestly. They they took down the EX Pokemon and I think that's what's important. That must have been a sick battle for them. Oh, they must have lost. Embarrassing loved. for us. Honestly, you know, you got to think about it sometimes. Like, sure, we lost, but we gave the enemies a really fun match. <laughs> they the won in a great go. way. But I'm really squishy. I, I did not expect to die so much. I don't know why I, I expected that. Wait, yeah. what role is this? What role am I? Attacker. Am I an attacker? Oh, I, I was a bit like thrown off because the rolly thing seems so up close and personal. One or and then more the parabolic of your trainers did not confirm their participation. So uh, given that you okay. were dropped out of the lobby, <laughs> the way it would look Wait. to me is that you were the one or more players who didn't click me. <laughs> That's just how it looks. Does that sound wait, like what wait, happened? Wait, wait, wait. I, I swear I pressed ready. I sure you did. Okay, so is ho -O a supporter? Kind of, actually, yeah. Oh, it, am I jungling? Oh, okay, wait, I'm going down here. It is a defender, but honestly, I, I have a, a theory. And my theory is okay. that it's actually a supporter, um, but mm -hmm. they didn't want to call it that because nobody would buy it. That's my theory. <gasps> that is a good theory. I know. You know what? I, I always thought it was like really interesting how blatantly obvious they were about like buffing um battle pass Pokemon. Uh -huh. <laughs> like I find that hilarious. They it's were so in your face. Oh yeah, they're serious about it. They're they're like, so we have a new battle pass coming out. That thing's gonna be OP for a month and a half. <laughs> uh we'll tone it down afterwards. Ooh, an Eevee. Oh wait. Any news on the next Eevee? I'm actually not up to date with any news. Uh, no news, right? We, Probably not. We oh, do no. not have new Eevee news. I guarantee there will be one because the Unite devs absolutely love the Eevees. They're crazy about those things. Uh, they love the Eevees. Is any them. any of the last three, I think, that you're looking forward to the most? Well, we don't, we don't know what's next. So at Worlds, they should tell us three Pokemon coming. Uh, the oh, only one we kind of know about is Armor Rogue, uh, Armor Rouge, which is from uh, Scarlet Violet. It's like- Ah, uh, ah, Armor Rouge. Yeah. Oh, cool. It should be pretty cool, Wait, yeah. Is this like the first time they're putting like, um, apart from the Eevees, I, I don't know what the word is for this, but you know how like there's Maridon, Coridon, but they didn't put Coridon in. Well, this... They did the counterparts or something. Yeah, I don't know. they did like Scissor Scyther is one, which kind of is. Like oh that, yeah, right? but um, that was like in one, right? Yeah, that was in one. So th I I think this is kind of the first time they're doing that. I'm trying to think if there's been another. Does Mewtwo? Kind of no, Mewtwo Y and X. Does that count? Yeah, that's another one that's like I guess it counts, even though it's the same Pokemon. But it's yeah, I I maybe it is kind of the first time they're doing that. I'm trying to think. Ah, so were you Team Maridon or Coridon? I was Team Maridon, but I, I, I played Violet, but I do think Scarlet was cooler. Um, <laughs> like I, like I do think like all the, 
what were they're not called like past forms or whatever but i thought those were all cool uh compared to like the future stuff i thought the future stuff was kind of lame ah oh, yes yep yeah. mm -hmm. but you are still maridon then or not really i feel like i have to be i have to be yeah it is i love also team maridon so i was really happy about this i guess it was more popular uh, Ooh, I I'm think coming so. up the top with you. I've heard. I get to see her in action. Yeah, look at the flames. I've heard this is true. <laughs> I don't know if it is, um, but I've heard that the the blue toned games sell better. That's what I've heard. The blue toned games. Is this another theory, or is this like a theory you've read? This not is your some, own theory. This is something I've read. Uh, is that the, the like the it's always like the the bluer game or whatever is the one that sells better. So silver sold better than gold um i think black sold better wow. than white like it's like it's sort of like the darker like towards the darker end of the color spectrum i think sells better that's what i've heard i could be totally wrong <laughs> about this but that's what i've heard wait marketers should research this what that is so interesting yeah well one of them has to right and i think it's like more often than not it's that like blue di i think did better than red and stuff like that so wow yeah Wow. I guarantee. That is very I, interesting. I guarantee I'm wrong. Now that it's one of those things, now that I've said it, I know I have to. Wait, be do wrong. you think someone in the comments will like talk about this? Yeah. I hope so. Like, Give no. us more insight. No way. It's not true, actually. <laughs> I don't know why he's saying that. It, that that was debunked. Everyone online <laughs> knows that was debunked. But wow, believe you know exactly case. what it's like to be in the forms. Exactly what it's like <laughs> to be in Reddit it, and forms. That's what it's like, you know. You can't you you can't have any real wins online, you know. The best you can oh, have is like, at one point this was true, but you know, like it's it's basically been disproven. Like that's as far as you can hmm. go. Is like at one what point you were kind of right. <laughs> um, I did that thing. I did the thing where I lost my train of thought again. Oh no. It's easy to do. You don't have. To Yes, very easy. Um, uh, oh, no, wait, hold on. Oh, I remember. Um, yeah. Slowbro, because we've two Slowbros now, and you know, every, I feel like, I personally just have some sort of like, um, let's see, a trauma thing with Slowbro as well, because mm -hmm. he likes to ult me a lot. Yep. Is he like... And I think Chris Heroes also really hates Slowbro. Uh -huh. Or does he really love Slowbro? Which one is that? I can't remember. He hates it. Uh, it is <laughs> It is the ult the streamer Pokemon, you know? So. Oh, does that happen to you too? Oh, constantly. Yeah, of course. Um, if, if they know who you are, that'll help. And then, of course, if you're playing, like, a carry or something, like, that'll be... It's just, like, it's over. Like, if you're... If you're like playing Mimikyu or something like that and they know who you are, you're not getting away with anything. My god. That is crazy. I always have the, the uh, so when I get focus, I have like huge benefit of the doubt that I'll have it like over a hundred times that it's just really awful. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh no. Like I tried to like rationalize why they would do this to me at my base when Rayquaza is up and they're losing. But <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes to be fair, sometimes players are crazy and they're just gonna do something crazy. Uh, other times <laughs> you will see a player and the only explanation is that they want to ult you no matter what. There's like nothing else that could be gleamed from it except this person cares only <laughs> about ulting me for whatever reason. Uh, and there are times where it's also very so fair. Dead. Like this is one thing I've always thought like if you are in a match with five random people on the enemy mm -hmm. team but one of them happens to be a streamer you know you're like hey i bet they're better than player 850318 like i <laughs> bet if i unite move chris heroes that's a little better value than unite moving uh who's our surrealist fire of elixir fire of elixir <laughs> might be a great player but they haven't heard whether or not they're a great player right yeah so i think it's kind of oh fair. no you can't complain oh, about it I'm too so much, dead. you know. That's <gasps> all I think. He's so tiny. He's in this long bush and he's so tiny. Cinder. Can I get him? Oh, he is so tiny, but I'm also... No, he's going to get no, me. No, you got this. No, please. No. <laughs> he yes, just Gyarados. took down two okay. EX Pokemon. <laughs> That's a heroic Cinderace right there. <laughs> you get it. Oh, that is hilarious. Wow. This is amazing. I have missed Unite for these moments. Unite for has sure. very fun moments, especially if you're just 
having like i don't know a better way to say it, but if you're just kind of vibing and playing unite has a lot of great moments if you're taking oh, it really so seriously good. sometimes unite has a lot of very stressful moments oh that's what i that's why i made like uh less testing videos and did more like just uh yes. trolling around videos because totally. the taking it not seriously is just so much more like easy on the stress levels for I sure know. well there's there's wait he's not attacking why uh i think he's trying Archie. to get away Let's oh, just, let's just wanna... hang out with him for a minute here. Okay, we hang out. <laughs> <laughs> this is pretty mean. <laughs> okay. No! Uh, Cerulej. <laughs> all right, all right. I feel like he was kind of trying to process what was going on here for a little bit. <laughs> well, he was like... We technically kind of like actually did a good play right there, which is we jailed him. Um, so maybe he knew... Or maybe he was also like, they're going to KO me, right? And then we just never did. <laughs> I'm super low. I'm going to just hang around. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Is this looking bad? Um, I'm low. Losing our Cerulege right there was not cool, but we're okay. I'll just quickly go heal. Yeah, sure. I did use my Unite move on him because he was level 15, so I thought I got to save him. Ah, that's good. Mm, Meow yeah, Scrot is scoring. Oh, but he still died. Yeah, he still died. So we we got the worst of both worlds. <laughs> <laughs> I used my knight and he's gone. And Mimikyu dump, jumped in and now they're gone. I don't want to go this way. Uh, <gasps> I don't know how to control that big wheel. Oh, they slow beamed our Cerulege. I can't get to him. I can't help him. It's it's a close battle now. That's kind of rough. Yeah, we're it's not even close. It's over. <laughs> it's, it's a battle that's over now. It's what it was is the EX Pokemon on the other side. I think it was Mewtwo's Unite move caught Cerulege when they were basing, and because of that, it it was curtains for us. Oh yeah. You know how people oh, yeah. say curtains for us. You know, like a '50s gangster. I think. <laughs> wait, 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 it's wait, curtains wait. for wait, us. Can you please explain this? I kind of like just went with it, but yeah. actually, I don't understand what that means. It's like, I think, I don't know what it came from, but I think at one point, maybe when people like passed away, like they, they, they uh -huh. drew the curtains or whatever, and that became like, yeah, it's curtains for you, see? Like that became. I want this to be like an unreasonably long explanation for this, and I just want it to get worse and worse because I still don't get what you mean, but I want you to keep going. So, okay, curtain, <laughs> hold on. Uh, there's got to be... <laughs> I'm just finding, like, curtain websites. <laughs> like, I'm like, like, curtains for you. And they're like, curtains for you specializes in manufacturing, repairing, custom-made soft goods. <laughs> um, okay, all right. So I found it. It's from... Okay. It's an urban dictionary. Uh, no, it's mm -hmm. this is Cambridge Dictionary. That's actually a completely different kind of dictionary. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it says, used to say someone will die... Or have to stop doing something. It'll be curtains for him. But yeah, are you going to tell me where it comes from? I know what it means. Come on. <laughs> where does it come from? Hold on, Tease. We have to find out now. It is a 1930s era gangster movie 19, thing. 1930s. Yes. I think that is just... I'm just not from that time. I'll be honest. I'm a vampire. Is that like a content creator? Peak MP? <laughs> no, not peak. Peep. Oh, peep. Peep. Like, peeps. like, 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 uh, peep my right. Wait, <laughs> <laughs> that actually would kind of count. The the list I have pulled up is not good. I, uh, it's just, it's just oh, talking like about people. people. Peeps? Yeah, it's just talking about oh! people. <laughs> Wait, that's so old. I haven't heard that in so long. It's these are early 2000s slang. So, yeah, it's been, tw it's weird to think about early 2000s, but that means it's been. 24 years possibly since. 24 years oh my god wait so what's something that you said that like was your thing that you always said um i remember i feel like everyone was saying things were tight like oh dude that's tight things were tight wait i remember that too yeah, things were tight i remember that being big oh, i'm from not from but i lived a lot of my life in las vegas and in ah, Vegas, uh -huh. all the Vegas kids said hella. We said hella all the oh, time. Oh, hella. Oh, That's funny. Yeah. Hella I, Vegas kids that, say hella. Yeah. The only people that ever say hella to me are people from California. Like, I've never met anyone 
outside from outside of i don't know if it's like just a california or just an la thing i think that's the so. same thing right i'm like really stupid so well so know. las vegas is pretty close to los angeles like it's a it's like four hours by car but it's kind of like the mm. city where i think a lot of kids from vegas want to go and i think that's kind of why we all started saying hella was because there were hella. la kids saying hella and we were like we're like basically in la <laughs> So are they still gonna like s hold on? Is it Side Strike or Future Sight that I want? I, I always forget which one I like. The um, you probably like Side Strike, maybe. All right, thank you. I, probably. I'm trying to see. Oh yeah, I yeah, I like this one. This is fun. This is like no brainer. All right. Do you remember? Do you remember Fo Shizzle when that was a whole thing? Fo Shizzle. I didn't know anyone said that seriously. Did they say it seriously? Uh, the president said it, dude. Uh, no, I don't the know. President. <laughs> probably not. <laughs> But did you say it, Sprague? You sound like you would say that. No, absolutely not. You think I'd get away with saying <laughs> faux shizzle and people would be like, that's how Jake talks? I, I think you should start saying it now. Mm. I think it'd be great. Can you bring it back? You have the platform to start a trend again. It's true. Like, this would be the time to bring you it back. You have so much power. I know. And I think we're in a time that needs faux shizzle back. I think yeah. we need that. Yeah, we, we need that. We, we do need that. Uh, oh, let me see what else you know there what's is. so fun? Hmm. When you're like kids grow up, you're gonna learn like so much new slang that's that doesn't even exist right now. A million from them. percent. There's gonna be all. They're gonna this keep stuff. you young. Yeah. Wow. Well. Uh, yeah, I think so. Uh, here's some other ones. There was deets for details. Deets. Um, oh, that's a good one. I remember that. Wow, that's such a throwback. There was um, pwned. That's just kind of like early in like pwned. internet speak. That is. That's that was definitely wow. a thing. Wait, can um, we get some like '90s ones? Because like I want to know what they said before my time. Sure. Yeah, I'll find it. You don't want any more 1930s gangster ones? All right. Not 1930s. Maybe a little bit earlier. Yeah. <laughs> like not not 1920s. Sorry, a little bit later. Okay. So or way later. Here are '90s ones. There's as if, which I, I guess. As if. Oh, that's such a good one. Yeah. I know that one. Like clueless popularized like as if, and I think I, they did. Good whatever's movie. gotta be in here too from Clueless, I assume. Get jiggy. Oh, they they set a trend. That was that. Get jiggy. Yeah. Wait, that's so. I kind of want to live in a time that where get jiggy was more used. That's such a like. It's such a fun word to say. Jiggy. Yeah. Get jiggy. Well, it was. This was kind of like we were like the '90s were sort of like the internet, but it was still pre-internet. So people were like, yeah, I guess get jiggy's. The thing. It's weird because now people be like, we're not ever gonna say that. Uh, <laughs> but then people were like, yeah, I say that all the time. That's you know, it it, it didn't oh feel weird. Oh my I god. Think. I, you know why? Because yeah, things weren't cringe yet. Like, they were cringe, <laughs> oh, wait. but I think people did... didn't recognize that they were cringe yet. I think that's what's did going on. Did cringe... Out. Was it like a different like way to say cringe back then? Or does that not exist at all? Like, nothing was ever cringy, everything was <laughs> nothing just Nothing was ever cringe. <laughs> I don't know what they would have <laughs> said. Like, what was before cringe? I feel like yeah. cringe is a, a big turning point. Like, now, anytime wait, you're is. trying to be serious, you're just cringe. Um, <laughs> like, I feel like we're going backwards as a species, kind a, of. Right a little now. bit. Like th you're not allowed to be genuine anymore because everything's cringe. Uh, let me see. Okay, here's some more. You tell me. Uh, I'm just gonna go through them. You tell me if you know them and if you don't, what you think they mean. Uh, okay. I've got home. Skillet. Give me a hard one. Home skillet. Home skillet. Well, when I think of home skillet, I think of a pan. Mm hmm. And I think of home, but if I think home is like house, but there's no way someone's like doing a, a slang with house. So I think home is like homey, like, but then it doesn't make sense with pants, so I'll be confused. Uh huh. Like, um, maybe back then they really, maybe pants were in, and to call someone a. This is going really bad. I don't actually want to finish this. So you were getting somewhere, actually. Um,. <laughs> You kind of said like like a homie or something. Um, okay, okay. So okay. home oh, skillet. Oh, oh, wait. Can I have another another try? Yeah, of course. So, uh, so skillet, I think you cook, right? So it's like fire. So uh -huh. like they're like like fire homie. I don't know something like they're a good homie. Like you know when you call someone fire. Yes. I don't know something like You're that. You're kind of right. Wait, is that right? You're kind of right. Yeah. It, it, home skillet is just like they're a good friend of yours that's what a home that's what home skillet was. oh my god 
Did you ever call anyone your home skillet back then? Uh, well, I had, I had two home skillets, but you know, they got mad. You know, they're like, you have to have one <laughs> home skillet. It's a whole thing. Um, <laughs> let me let me see. Uh, some that of is these, hilarious. Some of these, okay. I feel like these are kind of just like somewhat normal words sometimes, like bogus. Bogus. Oh, that's like crazy, right? Yeah. That's so bogus. Well, this you is, should do. Um, this says fake. Oh, sorry, or, this says fake or not cool, but it's just kind of like bogus is like, oh, that's kind of dumb, sort of. As I feel like, what you know, what I think we'd be more clueless about, or maybe you're more in than I am. Mm -hmm. But um, what like this generation says now, like the really young ones, because sometimes my little sister, she's like, um, she's like nine, and yeah. she talks to me. And I have no idea what she's saying a lot of the time. Well, there's like. I know that there's like bet, cap, um, <laughs> no cap. So there's cap and no cap. Uh, <laughs> can we can we just talk about that for a second? The cap and no cap. So sure. why? What's what's the definition of no cap and cap? Like to put it more like. Well, cap is know, just something that's way. like a lie. Basically, it's like that's yeah, cap. Then, like that's yeah, that's that's a lie. And then no cap's like no no, I'm not lying. <laughs> That's just okay. kind of what it is, yeah. So why does why does a hat mean that? Is the hat they're talking? Are they talking about the hat or is this something else? I sound so old. I'm so sorry. No, no, I'm like, with you. I don't know. Me. I don't know how it relates to hats. I don't know. I don't know if they actually. Okay, hold on. Why? Why <laughs> is it called no cap? Like, okay. Well, <laughs> the origin of the term is uncertain. Great. Uh, it, what? It's uncertain. It's uncertain. Nobody knows. Uh, originated hip hop culture, spread to other aspects of African American culture before being adopted by mainstream culture. Um, it, but according to this website, the origin is currently unknown. We don't know what caused cap and no cap. We just know it's a What? Important. Yeah. I have to kind of watch. Wow, Ray. that's like that's like a mis I would watch like a two hour documentary on YouTube about that actually, like to uncover the mysteries of where no cap and cap originated from. I I just want to know because it, when I think about it, too much, and mm -hmm. I feel like no one should think about it too much. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Oh, I should have did the cool Mewtwo thing. I didn't do it. Whoopsies. Um. You know what? We won one and we lost three, but I think that was. I think that's a good good session uh yeah when you're playing pokemon united if you actually win a game that's huge <laughs> so this big. one was uh this was a monstrously bad game <laughs> i'm glad that we you had know what? It. i'm glad that we had you know what no cap this was horrible against game no cap this was so bad <laughs> i would like to say though there was something really entertaining about hearing you like type on your keyboard while we're just playing unite and i just think that was just so base it was wait very fun uh i wasn't paying enough attention to what was happening in the match so i'm sorry for my team the enemies absolutely yeeted us but that match was a vibe check <laughs> when you think us. about it unite slaps teeds um i can't no i'm cap. having a moment <laughs> <laughs> the amount Oh, you please have a counter. What the amount of slang you just put into this was amazing. I was trying. I was trying. Uh, <laughs> Teets, thank you so much for hopping on and doing this with me. This was a little slice of heaven, as always. I love getting to talk thank to you. you. I can't wait to see you in Hawaii. Uh, I will anything see you, you want to plug or say before we sign off? Um, well, I would like to say, because my viewers know that I'm not very active on my channel as much as before. So I'd like to say, like, being on your channel right now is probably the most active I've ever been <laughs> on Unite. <laughs> and that's all I have to say. Awesome. Thank you again. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Thank you for listening. I all love right, y'all. I'll see you next time. Bye, teens. <laughs> Bye. Bye.